What's up everybody, Alex from Twin Gaming TV back with another MLB The Show 17 video. Today we're going to be playing some Ranked Seasons and Merry Christmas Eve you guys. Hope you guys have a fantastic holiday. So if you do celebrate Christmas, if not, I still hope you guys have a fantastic day. Make sure to subscribe with those notifications on to join the notification squad. And like I said, we're playing some Ranked Seasons, but I didn't like some of the people we added to our team. We pretty much got a brand new team and I like some of the additions, but there are also ones that I did not like. So before we get into our game, we're just going to make a few changes to our team. So first change I want to make is... Is at least I don't know if I'm gonna use Paul at first base, but I want Manny Ramirez to go to catcher. I feel like catcher would be the best spot for a creative player. So we're gonna go ahead and put him at catcher. During my stream on Twitch yesterday, I actually made uh some imp well, I didn't make some improvements. I fed Manny Ramirez during my stream on Twitch yesterday, so now he's 99 at every position except for starting pitcher. So I think he's gonna be a pretty good catcher at 99 overall catcher. We're gonna add him to our squad, replace that show's finest Gary Sanchez. Now for first base, I really like the 97 Paul Goldschmidt. We can go ahead and check my stats, and I have a 341 average and 577 at best. He's been really, really good for me, and I think I'm gonna keep him on the team for now and just kind of see how he does. Second base, Dustin Pedroia. I did not like this Dustin Pedroia card. I'm gonna see my stats with him real quick just to see how I did. Yeah, 182 average, 11 at bats. I just, you know, it wasn't working. Out. I really did not enjoy using him and a card that I really liked was Daniel Murphy I could, I could check my stats and see how I did 282 so probably not you know none of these guys none of these guys I've done really really well with Ben Zobers I've done okay with him a 336 average I mean that's pretty good but we might try and find a different second baseman as we go through our team I was really liking Nolan Arenado I do like 99 Miggy uh, and he only plays third and first base and then Nolan Arenado plays third and first base as well and I don't think the Paul Goldsmith place anywhere else so uh my average with paul goldschmidt let's just check that real quick is 341 and miggy it is 417 so i think i'm gonna put miggy at first honestly replace paul goldschmidt with miguel cabrera i think that's a good idea nolan arenado i haven't used him a whole lot i've used him 12 at bats and a 417 average but we're gonna keep him in just kind of see how he does shortstop i was loving Corey seager we're gonna keep Corey seager at shortstop for sure Left field, I was not liking Alex Gordon. Uh, center field, I want to put Charlie Blackman. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Center field, I think I want to put Beltron in center field. Keep John Carlos Stanton in a right field and now we just need to find a left fielder honestly we might do Lou Brock if I need a lefty I, I think I do need another lefty you know Alex Gordon lefty I think I really need a lefty right here so I'm gonna go Lou Brock I was gonna do JD Martinez because I'm batting like in 600 or 700 at bats for something with him but Lou Brock we've used him for 135 at bats 437 average so Lou Brock gonna be going in left field I'm gonna go ahead and make the lineup show it to you guys and then get into our game I really really wish I had Jose Altuve just because then I could put him at second base but we're gonna have to stick with Daniel Murphy for now he's not amazing uh, but I do think Daniel Murphy might be the best option for us we're playing the San Diego Playboys he has 90 D Gordon 99 Jackie 99 Joey Votto Mike Trout 94 finest Charlie Blackman 99 David Wright 99 Reggie Jackson 99 Joe Maurer 99 Jake Arrieta I feel like I just said 99 a lot we got Lou Brock creative player Stanton Beltran Seager Cabrera Murphy Nolan Arenado and Corey Kluber on the mound I really wish I had Jose Altuve at second base man someone suggested that in the comments of I think yesterday's ranked seasons video and I don't have Jose Altuve, and I also don't have 168,000 stubs. Maybe I have some people I can sell. I'll have to check in the next few days for you guys. Oh my goodness, wait. Is that going to be gone? Lou Brock leading off the game with a home run. First pitch we see. Lou Brock sends it deep. We're already at one to nothing. I'm so glad I put him back in the lineup. I hate Lou Brock, but I love him at the same time. Hit on the ground out to short. Gordon is there. Oh man, I, <laughs> I didn't think we were going to beat that one out. Stanton up the bat now. Nobody down. I'm just going to try and steal around the base. It was the Manny Ramirez who has 99 speed. Stealing again. A hit and run. Oh god, we got to go back. There's no way that's dropping. Yeah, I was going to say no way that's dropping. And no, a double play. Of course. Oh, well, we're already at one to nothing. Lou Brock homer, but I really, I think we could have scored some more runs in the inning. I'm really hoping that I can go 12-0 in the current BR run just because... Uh, we have a pretty good team. I think we might be 5-0 right now. We, we got a well-rounded team. We got a good team. And I would love to make some stubs and possibly buy Mike Trout and Jose Altuve. Those are two players that I really, really want on my team. And I think going 12-0 would be the best way for me to get those stubs. He's stealing home. He's bunting, and he's going to get it. Dang it, man. 1-1. One 
Not a bad hit by Miggy right there. Thought it wasn't going to get by the second baseman, but it did. One out, base hit. I would love to untie this game here in the second inning. Yeah, I'm, I, 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 I would really love to replace Daniel Murphy with Jose Altuve, but I guess that works out. And that's a base hit for Joe Maurer leading off the third inning for him, hoping that it doesn't lead to anything. Sack bunt. We're going to throw to second. We're going to not get an out. And, yeah, no double play. Should have just taken the out at first. Now there's two runners on for the top of his lineup. And he's stealing again. And he's, oh, man, trying to bunt again. There we go. Corey Kluber helping himself out, starting the inning off with a base hit into the outfield. Not a bad at bat for him. I'm really not expecting any of these things to be base hits. There's a base hit for him. Joey Votto. I keep getting, like, or uh, giving up leadoff base hits. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just, you know, after I'm hitting, I'm not fully in the pitching zone and just kind of get lazy again. But I got to stop doing that because it's giving him good opportunities at the beginning of a lot of innings. Stealing Manny Ramirez at catcher. No problem. I feel okay. I, I've definitely been struggling hitting this game. I only have five hits through four innings. You know, not a lot of stuff going. And I feel like I've been struggling pitching. I mean, it's tied one to one, so it's, it's kind of a close game. I have five hits, he has three. And I feel like I've been struggling pitching. But three hits through four and a third, I feel like really isn't that bad. Uh, you know, I. I don't know why I feel like I'm pitching worse than I am, but it just, it, it kind of seems like it, but I'm really, I guess not pitching that bad, but I don't know, man. I just, I, I, for some reason feel like I am. I don't know. Maybe it's weird. Maybe I'm crazy, but I just, I kind of feel like I'm pitching bad and maybe I'm not actually. Yeah. I have seven strikeouts through five innings, 15 outs. Oh, I was about to say more than half, about half, a little less than half of my outs are strikeouts. That's pretty good. I usually don't even strike out like two or three people in a game. So I guess I'm pitching pretty well. Maybe because it's only one to one, I feel like I'm doing bad. There we go, Miggy, starting off the inning. This is the inning where we really take the cat out of the bag and get that lead. Full count to Daniel Murphy. I shouldn't have swung, dude. Gosh, dang it. He's still gonna, he literally pump fakes the throw, and he still gets a double play. <laughs> Um, okay, that's fine. I mean, my runners were slow. My runners were slow, but geez, man, that's the worst thing that could have happened right there. It, somehow, maybe if we could have gotten into a triple play, that would have been the worst, but I think that's probably the worst possible outcome for that situation. I don't know what it is about me, but I've been grounding into so many double plays lately, and I really just need to figure out a way to fix it. Maybe just... <laughs> If there's a runner on base, start my PCI down here and, you know, no matter what, knock it under it or knock it on top of it. That's all I can think of because it's really become an issue lately where I've been grounding into double plays. It happens a lot. Five straight strikeouts for Corey Kluber. And there's no more number six because he's going to be getting a bunt out. No, there's a man. There's his fourth base out of the game. Uh... <laughs> you okay, buddy? I don't know what he's doing. We're in the bottom of the sixth inning. I, I'm, I'm going to leave Corey Kluber, and he's doing fine. We've only given up four base hits. He's doing really well. Uh, I don't really know <laughs> what my opponent was thinking there. <laughs> Manny Ramirez, get out, ball. I'll take it. It got him. Stole first and second. We got a runner in scoring position. Two down. Giancarlo, now is your opportunity to hit him in. There we go, baby. Let's. Oh, no. Dang it, man. Of course, I hang a pitch down the middle of the plate. You know, this guy struck out twice to Charlie Blackman, and I give up a home run to him, and we're losing. I really was not expecting the game to go like this. After that leadoff home run for us from Lou Brock, I was not expecting this was how the game was going to go. We're down 2-1 to one in the 7th. We are 9 outs away from losing this game. And uh, I really feel like it's not a game we should lose. <sighs> you, you know? 
I really don't know what to say. We're down by two now. I've been struggling. I, I struggled to get anything going after that first home run, you know, so it's, it's going to be tough. Uh, we're out hitting him still, seven to six. I keep grounding in a double play, stuff like that, and, you know... I really hope we can win. I need to stop throwing stuff near the zone. I, I, I really need to just stop throwing anything he can hit because uh, got him picked off. It's just, man, I, yo, man, I should have been pitching better. I got lazy pitching. That's all there is. And I've been getting lazy hitting, and now's the time where it stops. Now's the time where we take the lead back. There we go, Carlos Beltran waiting for our pitch. That's going to be at least a double. Probably going to just be safe and keep it a double since it's to lead off the inning. And that's all we need to do, man. One batter at a time, one pitch at a time. Be patient, wait for our pitch, and just drive it. 2-0 to Corey Seager. This is where he needs to prove why he is on the team. 3-0. He's on the team for a reason. I was loving him so far. Let's see if I'm loving him. Still, it is going to be. Oh, get out, ball. Come on, Corey Seager. It's not going to be gone, I don't think. No, not going to be gone, but that's going to be a ground rule double. Driving the run in. We're only down by one. Runner in scoring position. Nobody out. Miguel Cabrera. I'm batting like four million with him trying to drive him in. And he's intentionally walking Miguel Cabrera. Not a bad idea, my friend. I would have done that too. Daniel Murphy. Mm, I thought it was going to be a no doubter. <laughs> I was ready to say no doubt about it, but we got runners on the corners now. Only one down. Anything. Anything. But a double play, please. Damn. Oh my goodness. I was going to say Daniel Murphy again. Wow. We didn't get a double play. Oh my goodness. I thought it was going to be a double play. We just tied the ball game. Barely beating that one out. Nolan Arenado. Oh my goodness. I thought it was going to be a double play. Oh man. Adrian Gonzalez, get out, ball. Come on, baby. Let's go. Adrian Gonzalez, 5-3 to three lead. What an inning for us. We ended up scoring so far. Maybe there's more. Four runs, and we took the lead just like that. Wow. And that's probably going to be a hit, right? Yep, there it is. D Gordon, 0 for 3, finally getting himself a base hit with a bunt. I would not be surprised if he tries to steal here. Manny Ramirez, slide step, fastball. Still going to be expecting a steal. Still going to be slide stepping. Still going to be throwing a fastball. Still going to be trying to throw him out with Manny Ramirez. I, I was holding down triangle. Um, embarrassing. I think we should strike him out. He's going to steal anyway, so I think we should strike him out here. No. Wow. He's going to score a run. He's going to score a run, isn't he? Wait, no, 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 no. I just failed so hard. No, dude. Wow. Okay. Um, I wasn't expecting him to actually go home. Oh, you're kidding me. Really? Okay. Sure. And now he's trying to steal. Slide step fastball. Let me throw it, please. 99 overall catcher. Maybe my stats aren't good. I don't know, but I really felt like we should have gotten him out there. Now he's stealing again. If if he ties the game here, I'm going to be furious, man. We should have had him out at home. I'm going to be so mad. Getting out of the inning, that is huge. We're going to the bottom of the eighth. Down f or up 5-4. to four. We're winning. We're up 5-4. to four. We're only up by one. I would love to get some more insurance runs here just because, you know, in case anything does happen in the top of the ninth. But we are three rounds away from winning and getting close to the World Series. I think you guys remember... If you watched yesterday's video, I was up to like 798, I'm pretty sure, after that win. And uh, we're currently, I think, 718. So, you know, my game's on stream. Didn't go so well yesterday. Ball four to John Carlos Stanton. It, it seems, I mean, I understand why you would pitch around Stanton, but I don't know. It just, it seems like all of a sudden he's not able to hit the strikes on at all. Maybe I'm just crazy, but. Oh, this is hit to third. Will it be two? It's not a double play. However, it was awfully close. I got to stop doing that. We are here in the top of the ninth inning, three outs away from the win, only winning by one. Mike Trout up to bat. Mike Trout could, you know, tie the game one swing into the at bat. Uh, or once. <laughs> oh man 
Wow. What is going on? Oh my god. What am I doing? You're kidding me. I seriously don't know what's going on. All of a sudden, he's able to get all these hits. He has five runs in the last three innings. And in the first six, he only had one. What? Maybe I'm just being worse at pitching. I don't know. That was, I mean, that was a bad pitch right there, Owen, too. But still, we are, we're losing. I'm, I could lose this game. Oh, <laughs> I'm stupid. I, that's, that's seriously the best way for me to describe it. I'm stupid. I feel like I shouldn't lose this game. I mean, okay, okay. I was, I, I should have taken him out. I'm dumb. I'm so dumb right here. Wow. Okay. Uh... Man, I've lost my seat. This is what happened on stream yesterday. I just gave up home run after home run after home run. And, you know, watch this. I'm, I, 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 I could easily just be throwing it out of the zone, you know, just keep doing this. And I'm not. Why am I not? I don't know. Best, wor best way to describe it, I'm stupid. Let, let's see if let's see if he'll actually chase like a really far one out of the zone. That makes me sad. And that makes me sad. I really, you know, I don't think I should have given up those home runs. It's on me. I'm stupid. I made bad pitches, and uh, we're down by two. Instead of having won the game, we gave up three runs. Now we're down by two. He has a nine in on overall on the mound, and uh, we're three outs away from losing this game. Miguel Cabrera. Wow. Okay. We're two outs away. Oh, man. I'm mad at myself, man. I am very I'm mad at myself. Daniel Murphy, come on. There we go. Base hit one at a time. One base hit at a time. Please tell me we're down by two. If we're down by two, I'm going to be happy. If it's down by three, I'm going to be so sad. All right, down by two. Okay, all we need is a home run. Oh, wait, no, I'm stealing. No, no, call timeout. Call timeout. I don't want to steal. I don't want to steal. I don't want to steal. I should have. I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. I could have, I, I should have just gone back. Oh my god. And that's the game. I lost myself this game. That was, that was the worst. I feel like that's the worst I've ever played. What? It, <laughs> I don't, I don't even have an excuse. I just played so badly. Everything I did was so stupid. I was making mistake after mistake after mistake. What was I doing? What did I do that game? What is wrong with me? I don't know. I don't know, man. Let's see how bad the damage was to our rating. Let, let's see how much rating we lost for that. We're probably, we're, I bet we're below 700 now. There's seriously no reason I should have lost that game, man. I, I honestly, the, I, I, I don't want to make excuses. I feel like there's no excuses I can make. Uh, the, the biggest things are, I got lazy pitching and hitting. I just, I made so many stupid mistakes, man. I was swinging at bad pitches, grinding into a lot of double plays, and you know the stealing with Daniel Murphy. There, there were just so many mistakes I made that game. No excuse for him. I, I, it was just a lazy game lazy game and I was making dumb mistakes and uh, Hopefully tomorrow's rank seasons game is better because that was not a Great uh, a, a great game for me. Let's see how much rating we lost. I'm gonna guess like 39 In my last three games I have gone from 798 down to 680 I'm 0 and 3 in my last three games and I have lost 118 rating that sucks. An almost 40 rating per loss, man. That sucks. Um, I just got to start playing better, man. We have a good team. I, I think I found players that I like. We had 11 base hits. Not too bad. I, I, I think I found players that I like. I just need to not be lazy with pitching, which I was doing good with for a while. And uh, the, my last three games, I've been really lazy pitching, giving up a lot of home runs, hanging pitches in the zone. So I don't know what it is. Um, you know, maybe it's just a subconscious thing. Maybe it's that I need to put the controller grip on my controller because I'm using a different controller than I had been using. I don't know. Um, I just got to start pitching better, though, because I really... In my last three games, man, I've probably given up, gosh, like probably over 10 home runs. And that's just, I feel like that's not like me. I feel like I usually don't pitch that bad. So hopefully tomorrow's ranked season's video is better. Hopefully we can stay undefeated today in BR. Uh, that'd be really nice because I really want to go 12-0, get some stubs to get, you know, like Mike Trout, Jose out too, the Clinton Kershaw, just all these good guys. And uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like.
subscribe if you're new notifications on join the squad and uh, we're on the road to 12,000 subscribers comment down below any feedback you have about the team about the video anything like that whether it's good or bad i'll see you guys in the next video thank you again so much for watching peace out